coucou, ça va <rire> Welcome to my channel. Si vous êtes français, vous pouvez aller dans les préférences et choisir les sous-titres français. A ako ste iz Srbije, možete da idete u podešavanja i odoberete titlove na srpskom. You wanna say hello? Hello. 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 people. We don't like people. We like to be just us. Look at them. Look at... No! Don't go away. They went. Welcome to the lovely walk that we're having today. Today is, um, well, 8 of April and I'm gonna try not to kill myself by going down here. Go, 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 I'm fine. Anyways, uh, as maybe some of you know, the France is in third lockdown right now. I can't believe we reached that the third one. And we are limited to the like a radius of 10 kilometers we can actually go freely to walk and this was actually I was not planning that this will be kind of like a first video but what the heck nothing can be perfect so we start from here <laughs> in Concarneau. So basically that's where we live currently because we're moving soon. Concarneau is a small seaside town at the Atlantic coast on the western coast of France in Brittany and it's it's a very lovely town not too big around 19,000 people. Uh, when a day is like this you actually really enjoy living there because you have a sea every day. This is the beach of the Quatre Sardines. Well, four sardines. It looks really nice and it, with the sun. It looks so, so welcoming. Although have in mind the water is very cold right <laughs> now. Cold. I would not walking. I would not even like wet my feet. And that comes from the person who's a scuba diver by profession, but no. Anyway, so anyway, since this path here is within our 10 kilometer radius, we decided today to have a walk uh, following the coast at nearby two small bays. When I say bays, they're more like very narrow inlets that are called Saint Jean and Saint Laurent. So basically, instead of going the coast straight, 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 we're gonna make two trips down into the inland, then out, and down again into the inland, and then out. And then the same way back. So, just over there, through those trees, you can actually see the open sea. So that's where the main area is. And then we have this here inlet which is becoming narrower and narrower. What we are basically going to do is we want to walk this way, around it, and then the other way back there. The color of the sea! It's so beautiful, it's so transparent. 
and up there you can see the exit. This is as well a very popular area for kayaking, which if the weather becomes a tiny bit more warmer, we will do as well. Right? Yep. Say hi. Why are you? <laughs> Why are you? <laughs> Fine. That was Serbian, by the way. It's now on the other side of the bay, the inlet, better to call it like that. Uh, so we're on the other coast now, we're continuing our walk, and generally this walk is not a very difficult walk, so if you're from the region, or you're visiting this region for whatever reason, uh, this is a walk that I definitely recommend because it's easy. We are at the second inlet now, just in front of us, it's a camping ground which we will see as we come closer to it, or as we cross on the other side. I love it, it's quite peaceful. Also note, the camera, which I'm using now, has arrived two days before this lockdown so my plans for a very interesting video well prepared video and so on are now on the side because that place is off the limits right now but um, I still think this is going to be fun and another note I'm still learning to use this camera so all of you out there be kind to me, I will get there. I will. Yeah, he will shoot. The one thing you will learn about me: I'm a quite clumsy person, so I will probably fall in the future throughout the videos a couple of times. <gasps> wow! I'm making these expressions as if this is the first time I'm seeing this. I have walked through here, but it's just... Another thing, can you imagine all of that without this much water? Well, unfortunately, I will not be able to film that today, maybe some other time, but here we have a very, very big difference between high and low tide, and in these two inlets you can actually see it very well. Like, in the period of low tide you have barely any water and like right now pretty much and it's a thing that still fascinates me I've been in this region for a year and a half now and every time that I see this difference I'm like oh wow look at it it's there's no water or other way around like oh look how much water there is now reach almost the end of our, well, one-way route. We are now passing through the camping ground, which I've shown you in the video, like on a part of the video before. And we basically passed all of that, and then another inlet which was behind. So our Concarneau, our base from where we started this journey, is now completely behind. I don't know if like 
you can see now I will pop on the screen the like the video of the time when we passed in like what half an hour ago and no, you can actually no. see an hour yeah. okay an hour ago and you can actually see uh, how much the water level has risen the same beach of four sardines from the beginning of the video but <laughs> with the difference of two very brave people who are walking which is kind of a very popular activity here to walk through the water And you can see Concarneau in the distance and you can see the famous beach of Concarneau, Le Sable Blanc, which means white sand. And I have to say today, huh, it really, it really is white. <laughs> we are now on 15.7 kilometers, which means, well, the end is just behind the corner means will be on 16k which for me and Jan it's actually okay with this kind of terrain whether you don't go too much up and down where it's just a clean path this is something we like to call a, a normal walk oh, look how wide it is Anyways, if anybody is interested in like the details of the hike and so on, I have an account on Strava and I will leave that link um, of this hike in the description box so you can go and check it out.